Hello again, everyone. This is your Black Knight, and well, I've been busy. Just decided, you know, it really is impressive how many cars I have purchased on sale and then done nothing with. I finally went through and did a whole bunch of upgrades. This is, of course, supposed to be, you know, kind of like the Voodoo from GTA Vice City, but a little bit more tricked out. It's a little bit more tricked out. Uh, this one, if you're wondering, I have a long history with Buick Regals. And you know, on my other account, I have a white and one with a blue top that very much mimics the one I used to drive around when I was in high school, which was owned by my grandfather, and he let me cruise around with that. He also had one that was very much like this. I didn't have the turbo, believe me. It wasn't a turbo one. It was a plain Jane, very plain Jane, maroon Regal that actually did, I believe, have a V8 in it. It had the 301 dropped in it, but it just never ran right. And funny story, as I recall, something happened, I forget. He got, he, he got hit or something like that, and we put the... Uh, me and Dad put the headlights back together just to get them in there. And the low beams were aimed at high beams, and the high beams ended up aimed right in your face. Like, if you were an oncoming car, the high beams would go right in your eyes. And so as a result of this, we hardly ever drove the car at night. But I remember having to take it a couple times. And people would flash their lights at you because they think you have your high beams on. Then you flash your lights back and you would, like, they'd just almost drive off the road. He was like, ah! I just did drive out. Fun things to do in high school. So here's an homage to that car. In a much This is how it probably would be nice to think it ended up, although I don't believe it ended up that way. No. And of course, we had to, had to do up a dunk here and go again with the kind of light blue or blue and orange kind of creamsicle and toothpaste sort of schemes. You can see that's carrying along over. Went fast and furious. Went a little bit, uh, a little bit Richard Petty-esque on this one. And these two, I was just in a diamond blue kind of movie. What can I tell you? That was just how it, how it worked out. But now that's given us enough room in the workshop. And believe it or not, I still have cars that are in the workshop that I haven't fixed up. But we're down to, uh, we're down to 49 and a half million. How will we survive? Uh, so this was like five million dollars plus you know whatever was spent on the garages so that's wow doing these cars especially the Benny's cars it's it's an expensive thing it's, ex it's an expensive thing uh, let's do the time warp again and look at something new okay the de facto have to buy it car is the BF club hmm I'm just going to get it. I'm going to get it in orange just because I'm going to repaint it anyway. I've already got a plan. Obvious. Where did it go? I went, I went to go to hit the up button. I hit the enter button. It went somewhere. I think it went to the new garage. Which is ironic because I just came from there. Alright. Back out. Now, the Penumbra FF... Here at Mibahatsu, Miha, we get it. These trying times can be really hard to commit to a color scheme for your classic mid naughties race car. So we're look, we're working at parties with Else Customs to provide a livery for anything life could throw at you. Bad hair day, there's a livery for that. Stuck upside down your rhinestone gravity boots, there's a livery for that. Dad screaming at you, Dad screaming you, mis <coughs> Dad screaming your mistake long into the night again. You guessed it. The Penumbrum FF, adding yet more color to it, an already colorful existence. Well, that may mean that it has a lot of customization, but does it have speed? And for 1.38 million, it better have some speed. I mean, I'm sure it's not going to have, well, I can't be 100% sure, but I'm sure it's not going to have a tally speed, but I don't know that I'm going there yet. This, no, just no. Now that... That's something I could probably get into. Let's see if we can get this one properly delivered. 
I haven't been living up to my Rusty Jack kind of name here. I think we might want to leave this one a little rusty. And if you see that, ever want to build your own legend bolt by bolt from the ground up, well, here's your opportunity. Take this old beater, give it a lick of paint and a humble triple intake bug catcher, and power slide your midlife crisis right across the sidewalk. Immortality most certainly awaits. Almost really awaits. So we can, we can do that. We can leave this as a revved up but beat up car. Actually, you know what? If you, I just saw, I was watching on uh, VinWiki, and they had uh, an interesting video on a guy who's trying to find the original, very first General Lee from the first, absolute first episode, first time they ever used the car. And he did find it. It was a stamp on General One. It was actually had, you know, the it was actually had a, a plate on it that signified it as the first General Lee. But during the filming of it, that car had gotten damaged. And they quickly repainted it green to use as a, a, a junk race car. They made out like a race car that the Duke boys were dragging back to work on, being towed by the, uh, the next General Lee in line. And so that might be an interesting way to go. Maybe I'll make it a green one. Depends on what... I'll have to see what the liveries are. I, can, I have plans for eventually getting a Seminole Frontier. I had a buddy who had a green one of these. <laughs> he got rid of it eventually because it had the slightest bit of rust on it. I could probably work with that. I think he, I think he gave it to a family member. But he likes his things very pristine. There's, should we get this and trick it out? Maybe not immediately. That might be a thing for another video. I don't want to make this ridiculously. That's that. The other one's that exceptionalist way. Let's pull that in. Because the club is really the one. The club is... Oh, here we go. Check this out. We're going to do magic. Vehicles. Bois. Through to my garage. Yeah, I want something. Hey, da, 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 da. Yeah, I'll hook you up. You get it? It's, it's supposed you. to be a golf, and therefore it's a golf club. Huzzah! There we go. It's so orange. Wait a minute, does this... If we leave this as a matte orange... Could we could we be invoking a Top Gear uh, kind of motif here? Hold on a second. Let me think about this one here. Because I was going to do this diamond blue with orange fender arches, but okay, I got I got to look something up. Yep, it'll work. It'll work. We can invoke a bit of Top Gear here from the uh, the trip down memory lane hot hat hatch wrap kind of thing when uh, Jeremy Clarkson wrapped his own car all we really need to do on this respray primary color go with a matte orange boom we're there and it has the same it is, that's pretty much uh, the only problem is it's not a four door but we'll we'll work with that it's still no livery, no anything else like that. Secondary color, we're gonna leave. So do you wanna go with matte black on that? Nah, I don't think we need to. We can, we can just leave that as a classic black. Dude, yeah, I'm not gonna trick anything out here. We're just gonna let it be. Although, This is a, this would be a typical Top Gear thing to do, wouldn't it? That would be very Top Gearish. Just to blast Genesis that uh, Richard Hammond.
let's leave it alone for right now. Let's uh, let's go back up the top, get the performance going here. Make sure I'm recording. Yes, I am. Okay. Armor. It should get armor. Yeah, we're not gonna do anything with the body work. Brakes, race brakes. Bumpers, leave it alone. Engine, rev it up. Exhaust, leave it alone. Uh, roof, we did that already. We're not doing anything. Spoiler. Plastic roof wing. As opposed to like a primary drift wing or something like that. Cheap and cheesy. Leave it we'll let that all go. Leave the suspension, transmission, rev it up. Turbo it up. The wheels. Okay, let me look back here. That's pretty close actually. I'm just gonna go with tire enhanced, it's bulletproof. They did have. Hold on. There we go. Yeah, we go. We'll give the windows a light smoke. And there you have it. Now I have a fully functioning, fastest uh, compact going. Who was that guy who was sending me a, a friend request? Is that someone in lobby? Yeah, Jug Jug ninety three. He's level ten. He's new. He doesn't know. He was once friends. I don't know you, Jug. Don't friend everybody who's in here. You don't know who I am. We're gonna, we're gonna, we're gonna cut Jug loose. Although he just does need a friend. He's a noob. At least he, at least he, there's a reason. Like sometimes you get those random friend requests. It's like, why are you? Okay, let's let's cut to what's important here first. Livery. Rusty? That's pretty rusty. Yet shiny. But we have to get a, a mad paint on this. Primed. Looks even worse. Alright, let's let's go back here. Get the respray going. Primary color, matte. Get a matte orange going on before we slap a livery on here. So there's your rusty with the rust. Now that actually looks rusty. Now we could go with the, let's see, primed, rusty flames. That kind of that has potential. We could have done that one before though. Rusty Graffiti. King. Mm. Junkyard Racing. Now that has... That has some potential right there. Then these are the clean, uh... The clean options. I think Junkyard Racing, don't you think? <coughs> now, do we want to go... Having said that... We want to go with the green. It's not the right number. It doesn't really capture it. Hmm. Let's leave that as it is. Is there a roof option? Painted roof? There you go. And you got your whole American flag. Look, he's going What's on the painted roof? It's a Bug Stars logo. 
Argentinian flag. <laughs> They don't have the guts to put the rebel flag. Yeah, I want to make it look like a General Lee. It's, they won't even put the flag on a General Lee anymore. Because of reasons. <clears throat> Let's go roll cage and chassis. Upgrade. Roof we already did. Um, let's do some performance stuff here. By the way, nobody knows if this is actually faster than a regular Dukes. We have to, we're waiting on Ruffy for that one. Ooh, damage front splitter. That looks kind of nice. I don't usually go for splitters because... You know, you don't want to get caught on things, but that does look good. The d I like the damage one. Damage turns player. Like, you hit it off something. Grab up the engine. Exhaust. Side quad exit. Because everything's cut off. That kind of makes sense. I do love me side pipes, but. This has the look of someone whose priorities are in the wrong place, right? It's, ex it's exhausting through roughly where the frame would be, though. That kind of... Those look like they those look like they might have been handmade. Let's go with that. Stick with the stick with it bent up. Hood. Damaged performance hood. Damaged snorkel hood. Oh yeah. No question. You got to. Livery we've done. Louvers. That fits. You think the louvers would be beat up too if they had louvers? We'll leave the stock mirrors. The plate we'll leave alone. The respray is done. The roll cage is done. The roof is done. Spoiler. Weird that they're all black. Except that mid level. Let's go to the standard. I'm gonna leave it up. Wheels wanna leave the wheel stock, I like that. As it is. Although we could. What happens if we go to muscle? Stock rims. Ok. 
can put the mercenaries on right here. Does it make it more narrow in the back? Kind of looks like it does. Yeah, they get narrow. They get more narrow. Oh, we can't have that. I wonder if they change it. Can you now? Yeah, you have to have, to have custom wheels to do anything else. That's fine. No wheelie bar. I could do a repaired rear bumper if you want. Now, I was just thinking, I think we have to look at the secondary on this. That's chrome, but still, you know, bent up chrome. Like it's just now if you leave it if you leave it a standard color. What if we do um, metals? I don't have any metals unlocked. If we go to chrome, it chromes it. Does it take away the rust? Why would that happen? Alright, well, I think we should at least do a matte gray. Is there a silver? Dark earth. What do you think? Something that kind of it hints that there was chrome. Get away. Get away, get away. Let's go stone silver. Let's drive this. Actually, put my headphones on. See what this sounds like. I'm doing this kind of silent. This is not. I don't know. I'd have to do it side by side with another Duke's. I'm not. I'm not getting a good vibe off of this. I don't feel like it's as fast as the Dukes. I, mean, I haven't driven a Dukes in a while. Yet. See, does it do the whole... Um... Yeah, it'll wheelie. Yeah, it's certainly got the look, but... I need to figure something out here, just for feel. Why am I see you? Turn that to storage. You're through to your garage. You uh, need me to bring you a ride? I'm sure I have another Duke somewhere. Or do I? Like, there's, are all my other Dukes. Is this the first Dukes I've got on this character? Wouldn't be in the, the motorcycle clubhouse, though. Duke of Death, we could compare it with the Duke of Death. Which is not as fast as the Dukes. I kind of swore I had a Dukes. Maybe not. 
This is an eye-opening thing. I assume they had lots of dupes all over the place. No, it's not anywhere there. Arcade? No. All right, well, the best we can do is that Duke of Death. Where was that? As soon as I can. Okay, I got stuff to do. That's not approaching. Yep. I might have picked the right car. Does that seem a little quicker to you? Certainly handles a little better. And the Duke of Death is not as quick as a Duke's, a regular Duke's. I don't know. I mean, obviously it's gonna fall to Ruffy1322 to figure out what the tail of the tape is on that. I mean, it is supposed to be a beater, so it makes sense if you're supposed to be working on it. But that, that's just odd. Let me, let me, let me flavor this up again. First of all, yeah, I don't need this. This is going to cost me money. New vehicles. Slap that back to storage. Yeah, I should probably just drive back and get it, but... You need something, huh? One of your rides? Let me know. What else would I be calling you for? To talk about the weather? Beater I'm bringing it to you. Pegasus has just gifted you a vehicle. Well done, you. <laughs> because these guys are running a sponsorship, it's not suitable for the arena. But you can still drive it around town. Show it off and make sure everyone knows how important the Pegasus brand is to you. Call them up, see what you got. I think that's the taxi. I unlocked the taxi on that one ago. Definitely doesn't have the same acceleration, at least not initially. Maybe it's got a little maybe it's got better mid band torque. And maybe it has a little more hot top speed, but we're not really in a place to check that. We have to get to really tail happy, but he is a muscle car. I mean, once you get it rolling, let's let's get this out onto the. Where is the on ramp for this? This highway. Oh, here we go. This will be perfect. We'll do the whole Dukes of Hazard uh, jump onto the highway trick from the movie. Oh. I wonder if that's one I'd done before. I guess it eventually comes up to speed here. Yeah? So we'll have to see what it can do. It's not going to be my vehicle of choice. I can tell you that right now. But it does look cool. I mean, it's it is a, it is what it is. 
Oh, we screwed it up. I was trying to do a stunt. Oh, save it, save it, save it. <laughs> almost. Yeah, that was almost an insurance claim. All right. Oh, we're down here. We may as well move it. I know it's supposed to be a work in progress, so it would make sense to leave it at the uh, the workshop, right? Hmm. <laughs> Alright, well I think that's, that's probably all I'm going to purchase for the short term on this until I hear more from the Bruffinator. Bruffy, 1322. Check out his channel today. No, I'm not getting paid for that. He's, he's probably never even going to see this. I'm not even going to know I said it. I'm saying it anyway because it will benefit you. <laughs> On that note, this is your Black Knight. Have a great night.